Dacor Refrigerator Model Dacor 872750 Troubleshooting Dacor 54-inch Side-by-Side -side Column Refrigerator Amp Freezer Set with DRZ30980LAP 30-inch Left Hinge Freezer DRR24980RAP 24-inch Right Hinge Refrigerator and Installation Kit in Panel Ready Troubleshooting Dacor Refrigerator Not Cooling the condenser coils are usually located under the refrigerator. They dissipate heat as refrigerant passes through them. If the condenser coils are dirty, they won't dissipate the heat effectively. As debris builds up on the coils, the refrigerator becomes less efficient, causing the refrigerator to work harder to cool down. If the coils are significantly dirty, the refrigerator will not be able to maintain the proper temperature. Check the condenser coils to determine if they are dirty. If the condenser coils are dirty, clean them. Dacor refrigerator water dispenser not working. To determine if the water supply tube is frozen, disconnect the tube at the bottom of the door and blow air through it. If air does not pass through, this indicates that the water supply tube is frozen. If the water supply tube is frozen, thaw it out. In addition, Ensure that the freezer is kept at the proper temperature. The freezer temperature should be kept from 0 to 10 degrees Fahrenheit. If the freezer is too cold, the water line may freeze. Dacor refrigerator ice maker not working. If the freezer temperature is above 10 degrees Fahrenheit 12 C, the ice maker will not produce ice cubes efficiently. The freezer temperature should be set between 0 and 5 degrees Fahrenheit 18 to 15 C for the ice maker to work properly. If the freezer temperature is too high, ensure that the condenser coils are clear of debris and the condenser fan is working properly. In addition, check to see if frost has accumulated on the evaporator coils. If the evaporator coils are frosted over, part of the defrost system has likely failed. Dacor refrigerator ice dispenser not working. The dispenser control board governs most of the functions of the dispenser system. If the control board is faulty, it may stop supplying power to the entire dispenser system. If only one dispenser part is not working, test each of the dispenser components before testing the control board. It is more likely that a single part has failed. If the entire dispenser system is not working, the control board is more likely to be at fault. Dacor refrigerator not defrosting. The defrost control board determines how often to run the defrost cycle. If the board fails, the refrigerator will not go into the defrost cycle. Before replacing the defrost control board, first test the defrost heater and defrost thermostat. If the defrost heater and defrost thermostat are working properly, the defrost control board is likely defective. Dacor refrigerator is noisy or loud. If the refrigerator is noisy or loud, especially when one of the doors are opened, either the evaporator or condenser fan blade may be at fault. First, check out the evaporator fan blade in the freezer behind the back panel. Try turning it by hand. If the fan blade does not turn freely, check to see if the blade is rubbing against something or if something is caught in the blade. Additionally, Check the condenser fan blade in the back underside of the refrigerator to determine if it has any obstructions. Dacor refrigerator defrost drain clogged. The defrost drain might be clogged or frozen. If the defrost drain is frozen, the water will overflow the drain trough and drip down to the bottom of the compartment. If the defrost drain is frozen, thaw it out and ensure that the drain is clear of debris. Dacor refrigerator freezer is cold but refrigerator is warm. The defrost heater assembly turns on a few times throughout the day to melt away any frost that may have accumulated on the evaporator coils. If the defrost heater assembly is defective, frost will continue to accumulate on the evaporator coils, and the coils will become plugged with frost. If the evaporator coils are frosted over, the airflow through the coils will be restricted causing the refrigerator not to cool. Check the evaporator coils to determine if they are frosted over. If the evaporator coils are frosted over, test each component of the defrost system. Dacor refrigerator leaking water. If the defrost drain is frozen, 
the water will overflow the drain trough and drip down to the bottom of the compartment. This water can eventually leak onto the floor. Check the defrost drain to determine if it is clogged or frozen. If the defrost drain is frozen, thaw the ice. In addition, flush the drain with hot water to ensure that it is clear of debris.